This morning, the royal family facing questions, many wondering why Prince William pulled out of a ceremony to honor his late godfather Tuesday. The palace announcing at the last minute it was due to a personal matter. It was very, very surprising that William didn't turn out to his godfather's memorial. It just doesn't normally happen. You can set your watches by the royal family and they will be there on the spot. So it really is a, a strange thing to have happened. The palace tight-lipped on the reason behind William's absence, but a royal source telling ABC News that it had nothing to do with the king's health as Charles battles cancer. The source also stressing that Princess Kate was doing well as she recovers from her abdominal surgery. Kate last seen at Christmas and not expected to return to public life until Easter. We still don't know exactly what is wrong with her. So um, it leads to a lot of speculation. My understanding, though, is that she is doing well. It was a depleted royal family that gathered to commemorate King Constantine of Greece. The disgraced Prince Andrew and his ex-wife Sarah Ferguson taking the lead. While the rest of the family united in grief, another shocking loss announced. Tom Kingston, the husband of the king's cousin, who once dated Kate's sister Pippa, dying at the young age of 45. And in other royal news, just this morning, Prince Harry lost his court case against the British government, meaning he and his family are no longer automatically entitled to taxpayer funded police security if they enter the UK. Now, the big question is, could this impact future visits if he or his kids want to come see the king? Maggie Bruley, ABC News, London.